Hey, welcome to another Decompass 77 video and finally another video on this channel. Today is Monday. It's Monday, yes, it's another sunny Monday. It's very good, it's very nice. But it's already November. November the 27th. There's been quite a wait for my next video and there's a reason for that. See, sometimes in life, you know, we don't plan certain things, they just happen. And unfortunately, a month ago, I caught a virus and it kind of affected, not kind of, it did affect, it affected my vocal cords. So I couldn't really talk, couldn't speak, you know, I could have, you know, recorded some, I don't know, silent movies or something like that and put them on, on the Compass 77, but I really, you know, I didn't really feel like doing any of that kind of thing and to be honest I didn't really think of it just until now so you know maybe that's a bit of a shame I could have maybe done you know recorded a few of those but no it affected my vocal cords so I wasn't talking too well for quite a long time actually I got over that uh, the voice was you know the voice is like it is it's, it's not still not 100% but it's a lot better oh, really a lot better but now there's a problem with my one of my eyelids and that's why I've got these shades on it's not a nice sight it's just something that is actually m more of a pain than the vocal cords were and so yeah so the videos have not been appearing also because of that and so yeah I'm just just trying to do what I can to get rid of the, the eyelids issue at the moment and hopefully I will do and so yeah it's just like health health issues have kept me from recording videos, basically, and that's that's the truth. So yeah, that's the uh, main reason why the videos were not uh, have not been appearing. And last one was, I think, if I remember correctly, the sixteenth of October. Okay, but enough about health problems and all that. What's up? What's up? <laughs> What's up? How are you? I hope you're well. I hope everything is great. Uh, I hope it's sunny where you are. It's very nice. It's another sunny Monday. Uh, although it's not that warm. Not that warm. What I can say is that I'm, I haven't been completely like not thinking about this channel. There is something on the horizon. I'm working. I think some people say behind the scenes. That makes it sound more professional. Behind the scenes. Somewhere there, outside the window. Somewhere there is a branch. And those leaves. See, this is this is how it is. Yeah, see, it's coming to winter. See, as I said, there's something, I'm, pre I'm preparing something, something very special, something I would definitely like, will definitely like to share with you when the time is right. Probably not this calendar year, though. It may be sometime in January, maybe sometime in February or even March. But something is in the planning stage, It's there's a lot going on, I'm looking forward to it and if it does happen, because it's a bit of a situation where it could happen but it might not happen, however I'm really hoping it does happen. If it does happen, it will be life changing for, for me and hopefully for this channel as well. But if it does, if, if this one thing happens, then yeah, it's going to be really special and then I'll definitely like to share this with you. And yeah, apart from that, so apart from that, I have been following the sports while I've been ill and trying to get better. Uh, ups and downs for Manchester United. Some of the things I've really been happy with, Manchester United-wise, Paul Pogba coming back, Zlatan Ibrahimovic coming back, very big news there, and Marcus Rojo. I think, you know, Marcus Rojo, I think he's one of those defenders. Before the injury, he was he was really, really good, so I'm really happy that he's back as well. And I hope Manchester United now will just, you know, go from strength to strength. Last game, we what, we beat Brighton, although Bright, I think Brighton played really well at the weekend, really, really did a good job. And they, they were unlucky to, to lose the game. I think our goal, I mean, not I think, I mean, I'm sure that we were very fortunate to, to get the corner that led to the goal and then the goal deflection. Referee not seen Lukaku's probably foul on the defender, although I think it was one of those situations because this I think has led some people to say that Lukaku might be like now banned 
for like three games because he kind of like kicked out at the at the defender. I can't remember who who the defender was, but I think it was one of those kind of like he was just trying to shake the defender, and it was just one of those because it, in, if you watch it in in like normal time without slowing it down, it does look like it's just one of those things that he was just trying to shake the defender off and. Okay, people can say, well, what, do you, like, kick out? Do you, like, because his leg went backwards towards the defender? Look, you, you can you can have your opinions on that. I think it, if he gets banned, it will be a bit unlucky, to be honest, unfortunate. Then again, I can understand it. You know, if you slow it down, it does look quite bad. So if he gets banned, I won't be surprised. I'll be disappointed because I think that he needs to, he still needs games. But then again, maybe this is the best thing for Manchester United and for him. I'm not sure. But I hope it goes, I hope it all ends well basically for Manchester United I hope you know even if he's banned if he can't play in the Manchester derby then I hope we beat Manchester <clears throat> Manchester City when the time comes Hull City a bit disappointed with what's been happening at Hull City it looks a bit like you know club very you know not not a lot of good stuff happening to be honest I think you know the results haven't been going the, the way all the off field antics and, and I just think there needs to be I know if it changed, I mean, I feel I feel a bit sorry for Lenin Slutsky because I think he's a manager who can get results. It's just not working for him at the moment. Maybe, I don't know, maybe it's not the right fit. If someone comes in, I know I read Nigel Atkins, maybe he'd be a very good manager for Hull. I don't know. It's just something's not working at the moment at Hull City. I hope it turns around. I hope the results uh, change. I hope Hull City start to uh, climb the table. I really do hope so. And then Seahawks, Seattle Seahawks, we just won, we just beat the uh, 49ers, really happy about that. Uh, but I'm unfortunate for, you know, since my last talk uh, about the Seahawks, of course, Richard Sherman's season-ending injury, Cam Chancellor doesn't look like he's going to be back this season either. Uh, Shaquille Griffin also injured, although he's probably going to come back sooner than later. But yeah, some injuries there, not making it easier. After this game now, we've won against 49ers, as I've said. Very tough to, to the end of this regular season before the playoffs. Next game against the Eagles, who have been fantastic. So yeah, I'm not... Uh, I'd like to be optimistic about with the next game so against the Eagles, but it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. We've also got the Cowboys coming up. We've also got the Rams coming up and, and, uh, and some other teams, I think... The Cardinals, I think, and one more team, I can't remember. Oh, the Jaguars, okay, the Jags. So, well, they're, they're very good. So, yeah, it's, it's interesting, interesting. Enjoying the season, enjoying what's happening in the world of sport as well. So, yes, yeah, stuff has been happening uh, that I've been following. And so, yeah, even though, as I said, the videos haven't been appearing, I have been uh, kind of living, basically. <laughs> or trying to, anyway. So, yeah, I think that's it. I think that's it for this video. I uh, hope to come back very soon with another interesting video. Oh, one more thing. And I mentioned that little project that's coming up. It would, you know, this is kind of problem. I'll call it a project. It's not exactly a project, but it's something coming up. There's also another thing coming up. Uh, and now this is towards these videos that's ho hoping to improve the quality of the picture and sounds for these videos. But that is for another video as well. As it is, Take care, all the very best, hope it's sunshiny where you are, hope it's a really nice day, hope you're safe, hope you're happy. Feel free to subscribe to The Compass 77, comment if you've got a comment, and like the videos if you like the videos, and yeah, if you can share, that'd be great. So yeah, take care, all the very best.